Let's talk about hypnic headache. Hypnic headache is a recurrent headache disorder that happens in sleep. It is a uncommon headache disorder, so it can take years for patients to receive a diagnosis. It most commonly arises from stage N2 sleep, and from imaging studies, the posterior hypothalamus appears to be involved in the disorder. It happens more commonly in women, like most headaches, with a 2 to 1 ratio, but unlike most other primary headaches, it is more common after age 50 years old. So, for clinical features, it's a recurrent headache that only occurs during sleep and wakes the patient up. The pain is usually dull or throbbing. It lasts a minimum of 15 minutes, but up to 4 hours, and it occurs on 10 or more days per month for more than 3 months. Very important to distinguish this from cluster headache, which can also occur around sleep time. There are no autonomic symptoms or restlessness. The patient will, however, typically get out of bed. For evaluation, an MRI brain is done to rule out structural causes, as hypnic headache is a headache that arises in sleep, and any headache that arises in sleep, especially in someone over age 50, can be concerning for tumor. If giant cell arteritis is suspected, since this headache mostly occurs in people that are more elderly, then inflammatory markers should be sent. For treatment, you can try caffeinated drinks or a caffeinated tablet at bedtime. Endomethacin and lithium are also medications that have worked. For prognosis, about half the patients will continue to have headaches without remission, but about 43% will also achieve remission after treatment. So this can either be a one-time disorder or you can have the headaches lifelong.